Hey guys. Hey, Ranger Hi. Chandler. What are you guys up to? Uh, we're just making shark tooth necklaces. Very cool. Jeez. I actually brought some stuff that I thought you might want to check out oh, cool. on the topic of sharks. Um, so you have those shark teeth. What? But uh, this is actually what those teeth look like when they're still in the shark's jaw. Whoa, wow. they look sh <gasps> Ow. Yeah, they're, they're very sharp. sharp. Be I'm careful. Sorry. <laughs> uh, if you guys notice, they actually have a ton of teeth, and each tooth is followed by a series of extra teeth behind it. Look at all Ooh. these teeth down here. I know, they're like like hidden. It's like all their adult teeth. Well, those are actually replacements. So in case a shark loses its tooth while it's hunting its prey, oh. it always has a backup supply that it can easily regrow on or regenerate teeth as oh, it needs them. Oh, that's mm. really cool. No wonder they have so many. Yeah. yeah. Well, and if you think about it, a shark is a predator, right? So mm -hmm. if it loses its teeth, that can be really bad for it to try and catch its food that it needs to survive. So a shark without its tooth is sort of like a chef without its knife. It doesn't have the tools it needs to survive. Even if a shark could go to the dentist, <laughs> sharks don't actually need to because they've got all of this amazing supplies. Sharks yeah. can produce tens of thousands of teeth within their lifetime. They what? just constantly produce them. Isn't that neat? So they don't have to brush their teeth? Cool. Never have to brush their teeth. Love wow. <laughs> yeah. Whoa, these teeth are huge. If you think these teeth are big, you should really check out some of these guys that I brought. Those are teeth? Yeah. <laughs> These are fossilized teeth. Some of what? the largest ones here belong to the megalodon, which was the largest species of shark to have ever lived. What? Uh, what did they eat? Well, they were so big that they could actually eat whales. So these bones are actually considered fossils of the megalodon because it lived millions of years ago and is now extinct. The teeth of a shark are the only part that you can still find after they die because the rest of their skeleton is actually made out of cartilage, which oh, is the same really? material we have in our nose and in our ears. Cool. Yeah. Well, these guys look like they didn't brush their teeth. No, probably not. <laughs> Florida has a really long and wonderful history with sharks. They've always lived here, and they still do to this day. And they are a really vital part of our marine ecosystems. They are top predators, they're beautiful hunters, and they play such an important role in making sure that our food chains are balanced and healthy and keeping our oceans safe.